All right, I'm standing here with a new team of Natasha Purich and Mervyn Tran. Guys, this is your first Skate Canada High Performance Camp. What is the importance of this camp to you guys? Uh, just to get the experience, see what uh, our teammates are doing, and uh, I guess make sure we're on par with everyone else. Yeah, um, also just to see everyone skate and not, like for me it's more of the experience to skate with all the older kids. Definitely. Now, how long have you guys been together? Six months. Um, yeah, six months. Six months. Yeah. So it's obviously very new. Are there uh, anything difficult about learning uh, how to skate with each other, or has it been uh, fairly uh, smooth sailing? Um, fairly smooth sailing. Like, the elements and software hasn't been too hard. The um, skating together, it's been pretty good. Like, I've gone from a previous, like, six-year relationship to, like, this six months. So it's, uh, <laughs> it's different with that. Like, the comfort level is not quite there, but, like... We're trying to achieve that in such a short time, so it's been fun. And now, Natasha, obviously this is your first high performance camp as well. Um, is it a little nerve wracking coming in here, or is it more exciting? Um, it's more exciting. I'm trying to like forget about the nerves and just go out and have fun. We saw you guys over there with CTV. It looked pretty interesting what they were doing with the promos. Uh, what kind of experience was that? Uh, it was pretty cool. Like the whole light up system was really interesting like, to have that. It was like this tiny little circle, and we had to like do an element, which was uh, was fun. It's not the first time we, I've done TV stuff like that, so it was just okay for me. But first time for you? <laughs> yeah. Very exciting, I'm <laughs> yeah. not sure. Now, obviously, it's only been six months, so uh, how did you go about choosing programs for this year? Um, for a short program, it was a piece that our choreographer had for a while now. She's been trying to... She really wanted someone to skate to it, and I guess when we first started skating together, I think after a week of skating, I'm like, I'm sure we're going to skate to that piece of music. <laughs> and like, when she showed it to us, and we're like, yeah, we'll take it. And then for the free program, I don't know I how it came to be. I stumbled upon it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And what are, uh, <laughs> what's the music, what's the theme of the program? The sh short program is Tiny Dancer. And as you can see, she's a tiny little dancer. So it's perfect. <laughs> and then for the free program, it's uh, La Vita e Bella. Life okay. is beautiful. Awesome. Yeah. Very exciting. And obviously, you have to have goals for this season, even though it is new. What are, what are your goals? Uh, just to really get as much experience as possible and like to be at the same level as our competitors. Like we're not here. We don't want to look like the new team that just got together. You know, we want to look like the contenders for the Olympic Games. And if we get it, it's going to be great. It's a bonus. But that's the thing. It's really just a bonus for us. It's all or nothing. Like some teams here are like, you know, some of them are looking to check out and stuff. And for us, it's just we just started. So if we get it, we get it. If we don't, we know we have lots of years to come. Another four years before you can yeah. head to the next one, right? All right. Well, thank you guys very much. I appreciate it. And good luck with the rest of the season. Thank you very much. Thank you.